Good morning. It is February 6th. Wanted to uh, show you just our little uh, winter wonderland here. I don't know if uh, I'll be able to capture that, but uh, it was a cool little, um, you know, just a big, you know, they got storm that was coming through. Left a little powder. Looks uh, real pretty out here. Uh, I'm about to head to the store. Need to get some things from Lowe's, do some repairs in the RV today. Um, and I think we're gonna try to get out. We'll see, I don't know, it's pretty cold, but I think we had a museum or a couple things to go to. And then of course, later tonight, we're going to the uh, Walton Art Center to watch the ballet. So that'll be exciting. Um, looking forward to that. So, uh, all right, let's check out what happens today. Okay, so today I'm going to do some repairs on this floor. I don't know if we'll be able to see it, but just about like right here, there's a there's a soft spot. When you step on it, it kind of pushes in. You could feel there's a stud right here. Everything from from this point on is really firm, but just this little spot right there is soft. So I'm going to add some backer board and that way um, give it some structural integrity, kind of span uh, where the weight is being distributed. Of course, I'm gonna pull up these tiles first, make sure there's nothing that is underneath that it should be, you know, that I should be concerned about and uh, repair. So we'll go from there. Let's check it out. Go. All right, so I'm gonna pull up this one. It's the one I'm the most concerned about. That is gonna come right out. Okay, so it's not, there doesn't seem to be any mold that's causing the softness. So that's reassuring. Just need to uh, help it. Just must be getting soft in here somewhere because of the span and where the weight is being pushed at. So, okay. And here is the backer board that I'm going to uh, cut up and uh, put in there. It is pretty thin, just a, just a quarter inch, but uh, even though you see it broken there, it is uh, pretty strong. All right. And now the benefit of using this material over plywood, let's say, is that it's much easier for me to cut um, being on the road. I don't have a circular saw or a table saw or you know things like that to assist whereas this can be scored with uh, my razor knife if I get a good picture here and just cut I cut it all the way down for this particular so you could you could continue just to dig down dig down dig down and then um, come over and and be able to cut your piece but what's nice almost like drywall I'll be able to score this all the way and then snap it break these two pieces apart from each other and then you know do the same thing just make other cuts with uh, my razor blade so given as we're traveling around in our RV it's helpful to uh, utilize this product here's an example of so I been cutting with the razor blade and then I started pounding on the back side so it'll snap and you can kind of see how that separation is going and then I'll just separate it the rest of the way here in a second. There they are pulled apart. All right, here is the section. Those pieces did break, unfortunately, but I could just put a couple other pieces in there and then just fasten them. Put another piece over there and uh, see how that goes. Okay, here they are. A couple pieces put in. I still need to put that piece in over there and a small piece in here. And then of course, put the little flooring back on there. But uh, turned out okay. It's much better, much more secure. Happy about that. 
Right, here we are outside playing with this uh, popsicle of a frisbee. It's uh, all solid, but he still wants to play. He doesn't care. He's like, let's do this. Oh, here's Savannah. All right, so we're about to go to the uh, ballet, and the girls were none too happy about having to uh, get dressed. And uh, here we are, though. This is like, yeah, you had to. What? See, look, you're all you are is dress. See, Miss Savannah thought she had to get all fancy because we asked her a dress kind of nice, and she's like wearing shoes and tennis shoes and and a sweater. So <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah. Also. Well, but you would never wear them. You'd be upset with us that you had have to have them. Yeah, but don't because of what I'm saying. Don't get that. Um, where you, I want like high heels. Oh yeah, that's what I'm. That's what we all. That's what we're picking up right yeah, now. Yeah, exactly. Is that you want a nice dress and some heels? Yeah, I don't want a dress. And somebody's birthday is just right around the corner. <laughs> we'll get you some heels. Nice new heels you can wear for special occasions <laughs> like this. Oh. <laughs> Both of you. You want some high heels? No, no, thank you. Oh, okay. <laughs> Minecraft. <laughs> Mm. Oh, yeah, she does not want to get Nope. Look at the sky. Yeah, and you should take a picture enjoy. of the sky and this. Oh, wow, that is so pretty. Y'all, okay. 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 All right, and your icicle. Okay. Take a picture. Yeah, no. Oh, coffee would be nice. All right. We're excited. Memphis Ballet. Ooh. Hot chocolate. That's, I guess it's kind of cold out here. I can't move my arms. The only thing I can move is my legs. Okay. Oh, thank you. I got it. Appreciate it. You didn't think so? <laughs> so what did you think? Were you surprised? Yeah. Yeah, bad surprise, no? I'll come take it. Okay, so what do you think? Uh, one out of five? Seven out of ten. Oh, that's still good. All right. Out of ten, what do you think? Yeah. Okay, that's great. That's good. That's much better than I thought it was going to be. I was more worried about you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I was like, oh no. <laughs> yeah. It's a lot more fun. Yeah. Like yeah. On your toes and stuff. yeah. All right, here we're enjoying some delicious ice cream. Oh, look at that hot fudge sundae that Stacy got. Dang. Or she got a banana split. I got the hot fudge sundae. That's my problem. I'm always misspeaking. So, um, all right, first, what do you think about the show? Like the second act. He's like you. Second act was my favorite. What about? I like the third. I was really. Uh, you like the third act? Yeah, I think I liked the third act the most too. That was. Really? Yeah, because they threw people and stuff. That was I cool. Like, yeah, over his head, behind his head, and like the one guy threw her to it the other guy. Oh, that was yeah, yeah funny yeah. when everybody was laughing. Like, you were laying there, and I'm like. Like and then everyone like came on dance like no one cared about yeah. him. <laughs> He's just all they're dead, just yeah. sitting there. Yeah. yeah. Um, all right. And then the next one was is uh, we experienced some black ice for the first time. Oh. Yeah. So what you guys? What was your experience? It was scary. I thought I was gonna die. Yeah. <laughs> it was scary. You thought yeah, you were gonna die. It was such a small turn. Yeah. So then when we got to the. A bigger turn, like when we have to hit the intersection, I thought we were gonna slip even more. Yeah. Yeah, um, I heard this like beep, and I was like, what is that? And I was like, whoa! Yeah. <laughs> whoa! <laughs> what were you thinking? Uh, I was, you know, breathing like I was going into labor. <laughs> <laughs> okay, everything's gonna be fine. Uh. Yeah, it all happened so quick. I can't even remember what I was thinking other than, you know, whoa. Very cool. All right, well, it's 
It's been a great date night with all of you. It's been fun. A little, oh, yeah. little time out together. And uh, all right, Mima and uh, Capri went and uh, went to Golden Corral and spent the night together. So I don't know if they took any video, but um, they were jealous that they were going to get dessert. So we went and had dessert too. Yum. All right, and french fries. You can't have ice cream without french fries, right? All right, like if you agree, comment. Bye.